All right, here we go. Um, got my list of questions, so we're just gonna go down the line. Um, my name is Connor Bell. I'm 26 years old. I'm a florist, and I graduated from Cal State Fullerton uh, in 2018 with a BFA, um, focusing in animation and entertainment art. So, I'm six feet tall. My Instagram is Condor Bell. That's uh, Condor, C O N D O R underscore Bell, B E L L. Um, why am I looking for a relationship? Uh, I'd say it's less that I'm looking for a relationship and more that I'm now open to the idea of a relationship. I've. I've, I've done my dating, you know? I have a pretty solid idea of who I am um, and what I'm looking for from a person or what I need, what I'm willing to give, um, where to compromise. Uh, and so I think if the right person came into my life at this point, I wouldn't be hesitant about entering into something serious with them. Um... How and why did your last relationship end? Okay, we're just we're just really getting into it. Um, <laughs> let's see. Uh, I used to say that it was because we wanted two different things, and that is true for the most part. But what it really comes down to is it just she just wasn't the right person for me. Because um, you can say whatever, but. If you, if you really want to be with someone, if two people really want to be with each other, they'll make it work. And I didn't want to make it work, or I didn't, like, I didn't, I didn't want to do the things or give the things that she was asking of me. And I don't think, I don't think that's anyone's fault necessarily, it's just... She just wasn't the right person. She just, if if it was the right person, I would have given her those things without any hesitation. So, um, what are my hobbies and interests? Let's see. Uh, is, is going out, drinking and dancing a, <laughs> a hobby or an interest? Um, I, I love dancing for sure. I love, I love being social. Um, and I do love dancing. I love going out dancing, and I love hip-hop dance. I like the whole scene. Uh, literally half of my recommended YouTube videos now are hip-hop dance videos. Um, and then the other half are cooking videos. I love cooking. Um, and, and then on top of that is uh, reading, writing, and drawing. Those are... Those are my things. Those are those are my creative outlets for sure. I love. I I've always loved drawing. Um, and then in the past, however many years, I've picked up writing. Um, and yeah, those those for sure are my like base solid interests. Um, what are you most proud of? Uh, I mean. I, I ran this club in uh, in college for a year. I was president of this travel club. Um, I got kind of talked into it, and uh, I mean, I was really hesitant at first, but it, it turned out pretty great. I made some good friends from it, gave some people some solid experiences through it. I mean, that was pretty cool, but like, th I would say that the thing that I'm like most proud of, like actually really proud of and feel good about is the people that I surround myself with like my close group of friends those people in my mind are the most amazing people I've ever met and the fact that I've fostered this relationship with them um, to the point where they consider me one of their best friends too that's it, that's that's incredible. I mean, that may not mean a whole lot to anyone else except for me, but it means a lot to me. And that, I mean, that's all I care about. So, what is your favorite feature about a woman? Um, well, let's see. I, I mean, if I'm being really honest, it's 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 a face. It's a pretty face for sure. 
I mean, that's that's what I'm looking at when I'm talking to you. That's what I'm focusing on when I'm with you. Um, yeah, I mean, not too much else matters if that doesn't draw me in. You know what I mean? Um, what's your favorite feature about yourself? Ooh. Ooh. Uh, oh, I don't know. Um, there... <laughs> There's all these things that I used to be really insecure about, actually. Um, like, I used to be really insecure about my front teeth. Uh, I used to be insecure about my eyes. I thought they were just, like, boring and brown. Uh, I used to be pretty insecure about my nose, because I thought it was kind of big. But now I've, like, really grown to, like, love these things about myself, because I just, I don't know, I just, like, give me personality and character outside of my actual personality I, they just they they make me me you know what i mean um i don't know i feel like that's how everyone should be viewing themselves is like these unique things about them you know it's what makes you you so i've definitely learned to to love those things especially about myself you know and then anything that can be worked on obviously i can work on that you know but the things that i can't work on you know just you know it's you. Let it, let them be you, and just be about you. So, and then last question: Describe your perfect date. Um, I've thought about this one before. I think it'd be super funny and fun to start uh, a date night off going to like a wine and paint night, and then progressively uh, <laughs> getting more and more drunk throughout the painting thing, and then bonus points if we get kicked out of wine and paint night, and then we head over to somewhere to go dance for a bit, and we end the night with, uh, some late night fast food at, like, uh, oh, I don't know, like Del Taco, or Raisin Cane's, or, or whatever we're feeling, so, these are, these are questions.